crisis. That doesn't make John McCain a bad guy, but it does point out he's out of touch. Those folks on the sidelines knew that two months ago. Governor Taylor, you may respond. John McCain, in referring to the fundamental of our economy being strong, he was talking to and he was talking about the American workforce, and the American workforce is the greatest in this world with the ingenuity and the work ethic that is just entrenched in our workforce. That's a positive, that's encouragement, and that's what John McCain meant. Now, what I've done as a governor and as a mayor is truly have that track record of reform, and I've joined this team that is a team of Mavericks with John McCain, also with his track record of reform, where we're known for putting partisan politics aside to just get the job done. Now, Barack Obama, of course, he's pretty much only voted along his party lines. In fact, 96% of his votes have been solely along party lines. Not having that proof for the American people to know that his commitment, too, is, you know, put the partisanship, put the special interests aside, and get down to getting business done for the people of America. We're tired of the old politics as usual, and that's why, with all due respect, I do respect your years in the U.S. Senate, but I think Americans are craving something new and different, and that new energy and that new commitment that's going to come with reform, I think that's why we need to send the Mavericks from the Senate and put them in the White House, and I'm happy to join them there. Governor, Senator, neither of you really answered that last question about what we do as Vice President. I'm going to come back to that throughout the evening to try to see if we can look forward as well. Now, let's talk about this. The next question is to talk about the subprime lending meltdown. Who do you think was at fault? Uh, I start with you, Governor Palin. Was it the greedy lenders? Was it the risky homebuyers who shouldn't have been buying a home in the first place? And what should you be doing about it? Uh, darn right, it was the predator lenders who tried to talk Americans into thinking that um, 